Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. I'm the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour. Coming up straight after this Tiger Financial News Network noon update. Dow's down 325,306 overnight. Was down almost a thousand points in the futures. So this is really very good action. But we've been expecting that they will, after, especially after that peak in the Chapman Wave methodology at 27,580 in the daily chart, as well as the gap down, that's an island reversal right there, that there would be further selling and that selling should go on a little longer. And one of the reasons why I think it should go on a little longer is that the speculative part of the market, especially with I don't know if we can call them novices, but anyway, with a lot of people just coming into the market and trying to run up these uh, not secondary or tertiary, but really these stocks that are not just laggers, but many of them are bankrupt or just very poor quality stocks to be able to run up, as well as some that are purely speculative and they can run up on any reason. Just need to teach them a little bit of a lesson here yeah, that you've got to be careful. Therefore, I think that this consolidation should go on a little longer. Let's go through the numbers. The Dow now is down uh, 276. Um, we're looking at it just breaking underneath key support level, but it's right at the 50 period moving average. MACD is only slightly turned down, and the MACD is, uh, sorry, the stochastic is at 45%. That's not very good, but we haven't yet got the green nine period moving average going under the 14 period moving average. Strong resistance is at 25,600 to 25,800 level this week. The SP uh, right now is down 19 and 3,021. It is holding tight right at the 200 period exponential moving average. The MACD is just turned negative. The stochastic's down at 45% as well. Uh, peak E at 3233. I think the resistance now is at about 3038 to 3045. And it needs to hold today's low of 29.65. Weekly charts and month and monthly we can get into later in the week. Let's just do this because it's so important right now with the consolidation really just unfolding. We're looking at 235.32 down 56 cents. That's nothing on the QQQs. There are still so many stocks that are are really leading indicators. These are economically sensitive and they're doing very well. That's a good sign and that's holding up the queues. The IWM fabulous move from the low of the day of 133, it's now at 138. Um, this is this is the action you want to see the rotation to keep things a little bit solid. And gold, which was down sharply on um, uh, Friday, is also down today. I'll be back in a moment for my Tiger Technicians Hour. Hope to see you then. Don't forget my opening call. My